Have a seat, Rob. I don't know what to say. You're one of my favorite students. Really? We've barely met. Yeah, exactly. I love the students I don't have to meet. Meeting you guys is the worst part of my job. Do you mind if I eat? It's gonna be a while before the cops get here. The cops? Yes, the cops. You grab Miss Harnett's breast. That's sexual assault. I mean, don't flatter yourself. They're also coming for some moron bus driver who's token it up in one of the parked vehicles, but you're the main focus. So, I don't mean to be flippant about your situation, but in an overcrowded public school like this, if one of you students wants to flush your future down the crapper and I get to expel you, I am not losing my appetite over that. Shit. Fuck. All right, let's run down the hit list. You molested a teacher. You sexually harassed a female freshman student and a male hall monitor. And then, this is funny, you got in a fight with a girl and you lost. She curb stomped my genitals with her shoes. Mm -hmm. And then I called your mom, your mom and dad are on their way by the way. And she said she caught you masturbating this morning. It was a wet dream, I wasn't masturbating. Whatever. Seems like to me, you're going for a varsity letter in sexual deviancy. Can I go to the bathroom? Yeah, in your pants. Because you're not leaving this office. All right. Let's take a look. I can't figure out what make a boy like you snap. I mean, up to this point, no missteps. What would make a boy like you do what you did? I mean, it's a big question. Is society at fault? Probably. Have you got bad wiring? Were you not hugged enough as a kid? Rob, Rob, Robbie. I mean, what is it? You take Paxil or something? Maybe it's your home life. I don't know. Maybe you have horrible parents. But here is the hard truth that America is not prepared to admit. We're all just Filthy animals. And to expect us to play by the prude rules, that's re goddamn ridiculous. I mean, what you did to Miss Harnett, we're all thinking about it. As long as you don't sell crack or burn the campus down, I really don't care if you play a little ass grab, but. I mean, hell, if I had the budget, I would build us a windowless room where you perverts could just go in there and poke and grab all day long. And I'd make it all out of cement, you know, so you can hose down all the fluids. Come on! Is that semen? It's just a little mayo. My daughter made me that sandwich! That's a special sandwich! 